Head Councilman Garcia is posthumously, posthumously honored with the Special Recognition Award for the profound and lasting contributions he made. His memory and influence will continue to shape and inspire future generations, which is a testament to a life dedicated to the advancement and unity of tribal nations. The Garcia family is unable to join us in person today to accept this award. NCAI Southwest Regional Vice President Raymond Aguilar of the Santo Domingo Pueblo worked closely with Headman Councilman, Head Councilman Garcia's family to prepare an acceptance speech that he will deliver on their behalf. Thank you, Vice President Aguilar, for doing this. The floor is yours. He was asked to push your mind, Diki, at you. I did not ask you with but some who was open a kaisha, kasha, or a kick up, who was a hair height to see who to was child, height to see his coat, your height to see his car, your scout, you must not ever have the almost that you chew in the custody. He not is true, the Hina is child must be your coat here with God, else keep us a happy cock in something you would say, think I did told him a kasha, this is the truth. Good afternoon, uh, Raymond Aguilar Jr., Area Vice President for the Southwest Region, personal friend, and I consider the late Joe Father, a uh, father mentor to myself. Uh, again, express late Joe, Gar uh, Joe Garcia's family was not able to make it, so I bring you greetings from the Pueblo of o Okewenge, greetings from Pueblo of Santo Domingo, and certainly greetings from Pueblo Country. Thank you for, it's an honor to stand your heart and say this on their on their behalf. On behalf of Joe Garcia's family and the public country, I humbly accept the NCA 2024 Special Recognition Award on their behalf. Joe Garcia was an important tribal leader who dedicated his life to the advancement of tribal sovereignty and the betterment of our community in Indian country. He was smart, witty, pragmatic, and caring. Throughout his long and successful career, he served in many capacities as NCA president, member of the Tribal Interior Budget Council, All Indian Public Council, the Santa Fe Indian School, School, School Board of Trustees, and the longtime head councilman for the, his community of Okewenge in New Mexico. For those of you who had the privilege of knowing Joe Garcia, you knew that he was always working, and I mean he was always working. Whether it was walking the halls of Congress or the New Mexico Roundhouse, or more recently on Zoom calls where you could hear his, the sounds of grandkids in the background. Joe gave his life. Joe really gave his life to the work for, for that, that for that he will always be remembered. Joe Garcia will surely be missed for, for all those who knew him. It is my hope that all of you will learn from his example and continue the important work that he engaged in. Whether that, whether that he'll be convincing Congress to make appropriations to Indian country permanent, not discretionary, or by advancing the notion of education sovereignty for their tribally controlled schools, or by the childless serving of our communities in tribal council. The work that we are called to, to do in our Indian country can be difficult and thankless in times, but Joe's words are always, let's get it done. Let's get it done. Should, should always motivate us to continue. Thank you so much. Make sure this award, I will make sure this award gets to his Thank you very <laughs> See, 
Thank you, and again, on behalf of the late Joe Garcia and his family, thank you for the opportunity. Have a great afternoon.